Welcome back to the channel, guys. It is me, 8744. So today, guys, we're going to do my UEFA Nations League predictions. I just want to preface right here, guys. I'm not going to go too much into detail of these predictions because I'll make it too long. So I'm just going to give you guys my first to four to first. I'm going to go from bottom to top. Another thing to note is I'm going to talk about the format here before we get to the predictions. So for Leagues A, the top two directly advance to quarterfinals. Third goes to relegation playoffs, and fourth gets relegated. And that's a, and for Leagues B and C, the first gets direct promotion, second goes to our promotion playoffs, third goes to relegation playoffs, and fourth gets relegated. And for Leagues D, first gets promotion, and second goes to promotion playoffs, and third plays, you know, nothing happens to them. So there's no relegation in League D. So I hope you guys do understand that. We're going to go ahead and get started. And let me know your predictions in the comments below. And may, and best of luck to all the UEFA nations. Let's start with League A, though. Let's start with League A. We're going to kick things off with League A. So we got here Croatia, Portugal, Poland, and Scotland. Coming to last place, I have a Scotland. I just think they're the worst team. I don't see much hope for them. Third, I'm going to go with is Poland. I think Poland will finish third. Second, I'm going to go for is Croatia. And first, I'm going to go for is Portugal. Moving over to group two, I got we got here. It is Italy, Belgium, France, Israel. Bottom of the group I have is Israel. I think that's pretty self-explanatory. Third, I'm going to go with Italy. Second, I'm going to go with Belgium. And first, I'm going to go with France. Group three, we got Netherlands, Hungary, Germany, Bosnia, Herzegovina. Coming to last place, I have is Bosnia, Herzegovina. I think the worst team. At the third place in the group, I'm going to go for is Hungary. And second, I'm going to go for the group as Netherlands. And first, I'm going to go for is Germany. Moving over to group four. We got Spain, Denmark, Serbia. Uh, sorry, Spain, Denmark, Switzerland, Serbia. Coming to last place, I have it is Serbia. I think they're the worst team in the group. Sorry to say. Third, I'm going to go for is Denmark. And second, the group I'm going to go for is Switzerland. And first, and the group I'm going to go for is Spain. That's my League A predictions, guys. All done. Moving over to League B, guys. We got here it is Czech Republic, Ukraine, Albania, Georgia. This is the toughest group to call, in my opinion, because almost all these teams are around the same level. Um, this, is, this was really, really hard to predict. Uh, but we're going to go ahead and attempt it, guys. We're going to go ahead and attempt it. So coming in last place, I have it as Czech Republic. I, I just don't. I just think they have enough. They're just having issues goal scoring wise. Third, I'm going to go for is Georgia. Second, I'm going to go for Albania. And first, I'm going to go with Ukraine. I pick Ukraine at top because they have too much talent. And that's why I have them to top. But honestly, it's very difficult. This group is very, very hard to call. I I, I, I wouldn't be surprised if it gets the entire thing wrong. That's how I'm unconfident I am for this group. So for group two, we got England, Finland, Ireland, and Greece. Last place in the group I have, it is Finland. I'm sorry to say that the, the worst team in this group, they have been regressing for a long They've been regressing ever since they made the Euros. Third, I'm going to go for is Ireland. And second, I'm going to go for is Greece. And first should be England, without a doubt. Moving over to group three, we got here is Austria, Norway, Slovenia, Kazakhstan. Coming and bottom of the group, this is really harsh and painful for me to do, but I have to be honest, I'm going to go with Kazakhstan. I just think for me, Kazakhstan, this is a bridge too far for them. They can finish third. It wouldn't surprise me, but I think third is the max. I don't see them more than third. Third, I'm going to go for is Norway. Sure, they have so much talent going through, but they just don't perform on the pitch. And for me, the other two nations have performed at uh, the last Euros. And so that's for me, the reason why I don't have Norway second or first. Second, I have Slovenia. I think Slovenia is actually one of the most underrated nations in Europe. They're very well. They're they're very difficult to beat, and they're so solid defensively. Uh, the first I have it is Austria. Austria is just amazing, man. The gig and pressing they did. They topped the group for the first time ever in a long time. Incredible, man. Incredible. And yeah, Austria should top this group. Group four, uh, group four guys. We got here. It is Wales. Iceland, Montenegro, and Turkey. Coming to last place in the group, I have is Montenegro. I don't really see much hope for them. It was very difficult for me because I was kind of torn between them and another country, which I'll reveal in third place, which I have is Iceland. I went with Iceland third because I saw some little signs of pos signs of uh, uh, signs in the nations, the uh, Euro playoffs when you know how they look good. So I give Iceland a slight edge, but honestly, it could it could go either way. It wouldn't surprise me. At the second in the group I have is Wales. I think Wales is just a better team than both. But I think Turkey, for me, is just the best. So, yeah. Moving over to League C, we got here Sweden, so, uh, Azerbaijan, Slovakia, and Estonia. Last place in the group is Estonia. Not really much explanation to be given there. 
third. I'm going to go with Azerbaijan. And now we're going to get the top two where it's interesting. And I have to pick. I'm sorry to do this. I have to pick Sweden second. I've seen, I haven't really seen much Sweden. I haven't really seen Sweden do anything amazing the last few years. They've been regressing. And I feel like this isn't such a bad group for them, but I don't see them getting direct promotion because Slovakia looked really good the last year. Slovakia really looked good. So group two we got here is Romania, Kosovo, Cyprus, and that is going to be Lithuania because Lithuania actually made it through in the relegation playoffs. So this graphic's a little outdated, uh, but we're still going to use it anyway. Fourth in the group, I have Cyprus. I think they're the worst team in the group. Third, I'm going to go with Lithuania. Second, I'm going with Kosovo. And first, Romania. I think Romania's group is too easy. They should be able to top this group with ease. Group three, we got here Luxembourg, uh, Bela uh, Luxembourg and Bulgaria, and um, Northern Ireland and Belarus. Coming last place, I think it's Belarus. I don't think there's really much to be surprised with. Third, I'm going to go with Bulgaria. And I'm actually going to go with second Northern Ireland. This might come as a surprise, but I feel like Bulgaria have been so bad recently. And I feel like Northern Ireland have kind of been a de de decent, which is why I put them second. But yeah, honestly, it's a flip of a coin. And the first for me, Luxembourg. They, they should talk the group. Oh, sorry. I skipped through fast. Armenia, um, Faroe Islands, Northern Macedonia, and Latvia. I got Latvia last. Self-explanatory. Third, I'm going to go Faroe Islands. Second, I'm going to go North Macedonia. And first, Armenia. Moving over to the final league we got here, League D, guys. We got here is Gibraltar, San Marino, Liechtenstein. Third place in the group, I'm going to go with Gibraltar. I just think they're really, really bad. Second, I'm going to go with Liechtenstein. And guys, what, guys? I'm going to go with San Marino. I, guys, I think San Marino will finally win a game, guys. I think they'll finally win a game. I think they'll finally get promotion. And I think they can do it, guys. I think it's a good group for them. I think Liechtenstein and Gibraltar have been so bad. And San Marino have actually been somewhat decent, you know. They only lost by one goal margin against Denmark. They're showing some positivities. They scored a goal as well. I think San Marino, and maybe do this, guys. I think this is a level, man. I think this is level. Come on, San Marino. I hope they can finally win. And group two, guys, we got here it is Moldova, Malta, and Andorra. Coming last place in the group I have is Malta. I think they're simply the worst team. Second, I have is Andorra. And the first I have is Moldova. So those are my predictions for the UEFA Nations League, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy. I know it was a bit of a quick one, guys. Um, so, you know, I made it quick and concise for you guys. Not too long. I don't want to bore you guys to death. And I want to make it simple, straight to the point. So let me know if you guys do agree with my predictions. Please comment down below your predictions for you guys to like and subscribe. And yeah, I'll see you guys later, man. Peace out.